Sylvia, as a philosopher of mathematics, how do you deal with that perennial question, is math discovered or invented? I suppose I deal with it just like everyone else in the philosophy of mathematics. I weigh arguments for and against the different positions. Um, but I have to say, I find the arguments that are out there for mathematical Platonism much more convincing than those for so nominalism. what are the arguments on both sides? So um, typical arguments for mathematical Platonism, the view that mathematical objects actually exist, are that, um, first of all, it has a sort of semantical advantage that we can explain what makes regular statements like this skirt is red um, true and a statement like 2 plus 2 equals 4. Um, what makes them true is that the objects they refer to exist. So that's a semantical advantage. Um, another advantage of Platonism is that it gives us a way to explain the um, miraculous, almost miraculous effectiveness of mathematics in the natural sciences. Mm. And I think that's probably the reason uh, most people who do have this inclination feel drawn towards Platonism, this very close link with the natural sciences.